back. So, okay. I don't know what else to prioritize to. But, um... I'll go with the next one. You know what, since I should boost my confidant more than anything, I should uh, try to build my kindness any way I can. Go to the library. Excuse me? Uh, okay, for any uh, avid Persona player, do not be mad at me. I had no idea you could legit study. I, I, <laughs> I mean, I had an idea you could study, but I didn't think this was the way to study. I never did this. I just like, I don't know. Okay. hasn't gained regain consciousness that I had to go and make amends. What do you mean? You didn't do anything wrong, on Right, Ren? It's not your fault, Anne. But I wasn't there when she needed help. I'm a failure as a friend. I have to do all I can to make up for that, starting now. Otherwise, I don't think I'll be able to move on. Man, I didn't know you were passionate. I totally didn't notice that back in high school, middle school. I think it's because of you guys. I'm a little embarrassed, though. Anyway, Ryuji, Ren, I hope we can keep helping each other out from now on, too. Hey, got a minute? Something I want to ask you. Come here, let's have a chat. Alright. Yo. Hey, you're free tonight, aren't you? Care to have a ch little chat with me? Uh, what? It's just some small talk. They... This may be a good opportunity to deepen my bond with social media. Yo. Oh. There's a lot of things I want to ask you. I'll clean up, so just wait here. Hey, how's school? You're not causing any trouble, are you? I'm not. Good. I've got to report to your probation officer twice a month. It's already a pain in the ass as is, so please don't make me have to write even more crap. Got that? This society is kept in check by laws and authority figures. You can go and get yourself killed if you want, but don't go dragging other people into your mess. The last thing we need is more idiots like you roaming around. 
Hmm? What's wrong? Yeah, I'm heading out now. Sorry about that. I know. The usual, right? Okay. I'll see you later. As you can see, I'm pretty damn busy both at work and in my private life. If you could lend a hand, it'd really be a great help. I'd be glad to. Now we're talking. Either way, I won't ask you to work for free. If you agree to help me, then I'll teach you how to make the perfect cup of coffee. Not a bad trade, eh? Sounds interesting. All right. Looks like we got ourselves a deal. You may call yourself a phantom thief, but you're still a miner. Someone had to support you. Furthermore, they did so knowing you were a part of that group. Isn't the owner of that cafe an accomplice of yours? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Hierophant persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. I'll be counting on your help. I owe you one. Okay, I'll let you handle the rest. Gotta say, I'm glad you kept on quick with this stuff. It makes my life a whole lot easier. Just keep doing what you can and don't cause any trouble, right? Got it. Oh. Glad to hear it. Oh yeah. I didn't even, I just thought it would make sense, you know. I I didn't I didn't think this was a <laughs> confidant building thing yet, <laughs> but uh, here we are. I'm gonna head back then. It should be a lot easier knowing the characters and their motivations and their lingo. Yeah. Cause originally I was gonna go to a guide on confidant building to make sure I ace it. But I think I'm confident to know the characters well enough to know that the responses will be what would be least favored or well favored. So yeah, I'm just gonna go with my gut. Hmm. Like I said, hmm. this this is I wanted to challenge myself. Either I succeed or I fail, you know. Anyways, and y'all will be down for the ride anyway. You know, whether I succeed or fail at this. 100% run. Now, this 100% run, I'm not just going for, uh, I'm not just going for the pro the platinum for this game. I'm going to 100% ma um, majority of, uh, things. Like, max self fluid stats, max, uh, confidants, uh, all the will seeds. I know I lost over the will seeds in uh in the first palace i got all of them in the last playthrough but i only did that because uh of time's sake i didn't want to spend time looking for them and i already know that uh you can get them again in mementos so considering that i will grind in mementos and everything that's not gonna be a problem you know to be grinding in mementos constantly I can get all the will seeds again, especially in the, uh, especially in the, um, in the later parts of the game, you know, they get will seeds from different places. I don't know if, like, it's time sensitive with these will seeds, but if it is, you know, I might have to, like, be really vigilant with, uh, the availability of will seeds. So, I'll try to get them all in the next palace. Because I know, like, if that's the case, that would be added pressure, so. The school 
Stewart always out of Yakasoba's hands, no matter what time I go. I haven't been able to get any once. Oh, you don't know? It's always sold out on Mondays, but there's usually some leftover on Fridays. Are you serious? I'll finally be able to get some Yakasobi pen hey. today. Huh, I guess there's a lot on in this world you can get only for a limited time or during certain seasons. Now I want some too. Wow. Do you want to come you wanna to try to get some? I'll come with you. I would honestly, but I kinda wanna at least oh You know, running around in that palace made me realize something. I ain't moving well at all. My body's out of whack. I gotta start training again. Practice is real important. So, I'm gonna start today. Start again as of today. You wanna join in? Alright. Sick. Let's sweat it out behind the gym. Go get chains with some training gear and get your ass over here. Hmm. Man, this place really brings back memories. This is my secret training spot, or it was. Uh, back when I was on the track team. Actually, I've been thinking about trying to run again. Damn it. Fighting in that other world was a total shock. I couldn't move like I used to, it just felt lame. So I just started thinking I need to build up my muscles again. Anything's got to be better than this flimsy body, right? Plus, maybe then I'll be able to help out a little more. I'm counting on you, bro. Heh, <laughs> 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 I'm totally gonna wreck your expectations. Uh, I mean that in a good way. Anyways, you act like it's only me who's gonna be doing this. You're getting in on it, too. Come on, man. Whoa, don't look surprised. Why'd you think I had to go and change into that? And it'd be pointless if I was only one getting super fast. Right? Alright, I'm gonna do some knee lifts, friend. You're stuck with the normal ones. I ran around the school with beauty. Damn, my legs are all tight. Before Kamashita came along, the track team was the biggest thing the school had going for it. But it all changed after he got our coach fired and took over as the sub. Damn it. That bastard. Right from the very start, he was trying to get rid of us. He'd give us crazy workouts when we couldn't do them. He'd add even more on top of that. Day after day, it was nothing but that bullshit. He was going after me especially. He knew. He knew I was the kind of guy who would fight back. If my time dropped even a little, he cussed me out. Then on top of that, he brought up my parents. And then you punched him. Truth is, my mom's the only one I got. All my dad did was when he was around was drink. Sometimes he'd even beat me or my mom. I didn't I don't know how that bastard Kamasita found out, but he found he told the whole goddamn team. And as you can guess, I lost it and hit him. It was like he wanted me to do it though. He called it an act of violence and shut the team down. Thanks to that, the other guys on the team treat me like some kind of traitor. And they ain't wrong. Because of me, they all lost their shot at the championship. Do you regret it? A little bit yes. And a little bit no. Come on, don't ask me tough questions like that. I'm not very smart, you know. <laughs> Anyway, it doesn't matter, that's all in the past. 
I'm only thinking about the future now. That's what we're gonna build the, do, build the future. We gotta think positive thoughts, brother. I feel like my bond with Fuji is deep, growing deeper. All right. All right. Come on, we're all warmed up, right? How about another run? By the way, you're actually pretty good at running. Not as bad as me. Not as good as me. <laughs> wow. I'm gonna shade him there. Not as good as me, though. Holy crap, my legs are shaking. Don't collapse on your way home, man. Later. What's up? You got home okay? Didn't trip or anything. But man, I'm I'm so out of shape. Felt like I could barely drag my damn legs up the station steps. This would have never happened back then. I should have kept up my running. It's never too late, man. It's never too late. Truth, man. We're only getting started. Let's keep on running towards tomorrow. I'm pretty rusty, but even if I got kind of rough, I had fun. And with a few here, I get some friends in the competition, plus we get to talk. See you. Uh, that's all I can read to see you. I didn't mean to skip all that. <laughs> ah, you're back. So, getting used to the city? A little. I see. You're the only one here at night, so I'm not gonna bother setting a curfew or anything like that. So as long as you're taking school serious, I don't mind if you stroll the streets in the evenings. You got that? But only a around those parts. Got it? You'll go back on you go back on your word, I'll kick you right out. Hey. I'm the one who gets to lock the door, just make sure you're not out for too long, right? <sighs> we were told that we couldn't go very far, so I guess that means we gotta enjoy the nightlife and youngin'. How about we take a peek inside that bathhouse? I probably can't go in as a cat. I saw a sign for a movie theater as well, and both were going, uh, and there were some batting cages too. There are so many things to do, this is gonna be fun. Alright. How can I help you? Wait a minute, let me get this. This is very important with the confidant building. Uh. That. All right. Is the doctor's clothes? Probably. No, it's not. I have to ask her about the enhancing drugs. Well, oh, it's guts. Got any special medication? That's gonna be guts. Huh? Uh, my I have reasons. My reasons. <sighs> Very well, just had an exam. Oh! I thought it had to oh. be guts, that's why I was skipping. That medicine, huh? What are you trying to do? So which conversation of mine did you eavesdrop on to hear that? It was obvious actually, you call that hiding? Not that I care, of course. I was going to dispose of that medicine anyway, I got a little carried away with it. But tell me, why would a high school literally like yourself would be so interested in that medicine? It's very strange indeed, you don't seem very athletic. So what exactly are you up to? It's for brain power. It's for brain power. Huh? Oh, for your interest in him? So you're looking to improve your concentration and reduce fatigue. That's not the best idea. But what if you want what it what you wanna do? If that's what you wanna do. Take care. Then good luck with that. I have no obligation to help you with that. Why don't you have an energy drink or something? I need that medicine. You're really annoying, you know that? The medicine is really expensive. 
It's not something a high schooler can get his hands on. It costs almost as much as a car. Oh, you know I got that. Hey, I got that from DLC. I can I can buy it, you know. I can buy it right off and we can just skip this whole confidant thing. Okay. Make me no difference. <laughs> it's like Nah, I, I do want to build confidants for everyone. So. so how about you just go home? I'm not leaving. Do you consider yourself someone with a good amount of stamina? I admit I've been looking for a young person around your age to help me out, but I haven't been able to find one even after putting an ad in the paper. Are you up for it? How much does it pay? Let's just say it'll be worth it. Okay then, you'll be participating in clinical trials for my medicine. Hang on, I'll be right back. <laughs> Here you go. Worried about the side effects? Well, you can relax. Best of Stewart, my autopsy is guaranteed to find out exactly what part killed you. Did you change your mind? What, aren't you gonna take it? The exit's right here if you wanna leave. Well, go on. Don't mind if I do. What? Huh? I can't believe you actually drank it. Bitter yet sour is beyond description. However, it's nothing I can't handle. Wow, still doing okay, huh? Not bad for a high schooler. Uh. <sighs> well, game over, I guess. Good evening. Do you remember anything from the moment you took the medicine until now? Hmm. By the look in your eyes, I'd say you don't. You briefly woke from your coma, but you were completely dazed during the entire examination. You eventually lost consciousness and fell back asleep. Are you out of your mind? Only an idiot would have drank that. It's for my exams. Fine. By the way, the reason you lost consciousness was because of the taste. It produces a foul smell when it mixes with gastric juices, similar to surstroming. Oh well. All that matters is that thanks to you, I was able to get some good data. Okay, it's my turn to make good on my part of the deal. That's why I waited until you woke up. I don't want the general public to know about my original medicines. So, you're strictly prohibited from disclosing what happens here to anyone. Understood? Then it's a deal. As long as you come here for it, I'll give you the medicine at a good price whenever you want. I may even add additional selections in time. I look forward to your continued patronage. Considering all the actions you've taken, you must have had someone with medical expertise. Who? And how did you treat your wounds? It'll be easy to find out who if we look into this, you know. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Death Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. So, when can you come back for the next clinical trial? Oh. You don't remember that part either? Well, I was saying that teenage test subjects are quite valuable in the medical research industry. So I'll provide you the medicine for your entrance exams, and in exchange, you'll be my guinea pig. I have to perfect this medicine. If you're able to move now, you can go home. All right, 
Take care. Hey. Oh yeah, I'll contact you when I'm done prepping for the next clinical trial. I'll put together some compensation by then for all your efforts, but you're not getting in that you're not getting that in writing. Based on today's results, I think I can whip up some new medicine for next time. Stop by when you're ready for it. Please go easy on me. <laughs> we'll see. That's up to you. You live pretty close, right? You might still feel some dizziness, so take it easy on your way All home. Alright, take care. I'm not really in the mood to write up an autopsy, so take care of yourself. still haven't done much of anything on my days off. It's such a pain to put on makeup. I hate shopping, so I usually end up blazing about the yeah. house. Same here goes, good thing there's home shopping. They always have the best stuff on Sundays. Oh, I know exactly what, you, what show you're talking about. They even sell surgical masks for when you're sick. I have to check it out tomorrow. It's so popular they always sell out if you don't call the same day. Morning! What up? I made it. I slept in, so I ran out without eating. I feel so weak because of it. After we took down Kamashita, I just felt so spent and out of gas. You know, you get me, right? I do. Yep. Right. Now all we have to do is wait for that board meeting. Anyways, I'm hungry. I guess I'll buy some bread at the school store. Ahem. Kamashita kun was really in his element at the volleyball rally the other day. You kids are lucky to receive direct instructions from a world-famous athlete like him. Sports have been regarded as sacred things that invigorate people since the ancient times. So much so that an emperor himself even participated once. Ishima kun uh, Do you know the name of the Roman Empire emperor who participated in the Olympic Olympics? Huh? Um... It's Nero. It's so good to throw yourself into your club activities, but you shouldn't sacrifice the studies. Sorry. That said, you don't seem to be into sports. Do you know the answer? Between music, theater, and chariot races, what sport did Nero win when he participated in the Olympics? This is it. Correct. It seems you have been studying after all. Nero won many awards in all kinds of competitions, all rigged in his favor, of course. Because of these kinds of selfish acts, not to mention a lecturer's side, he became known as the Devil Nice going! That said, recently people have been gone to reevaluating Nero's reign. Regardless though, he was lacking in sportsmanship. He should have taken a page out of Kamashita Kun's book. No, no, no. Don't give us that crap, Kamashita's the real death spot. <sighs> I could use some fresh air. Take me somewhere outside. Really? All right. Only because you asked. Gotta study, man. 
I got I gotta study, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Wakanda, I gotta study. Hey! Hey! Anything about stuff happening in the Kamashita? Nope. I see. Did something happen? I don't know, I'm just feeling kinda anxious. I keep thinking about how with you all you did, we might still end up getting this built. My mom's totally gonna suffer if that happens. Plus, if we couldn't even help An or Suzui, we have to believe. Sorry, I guess now is not really the time to be getting all down in the dumps. Anyways, I'm feeling a little better now that I've talked to you about this. And don't tell Ayn I was doubting us, okay? She won't have to rely on... She won't have anyone to rely on if we're all worried about this. Well, see ya. Hey. About that stuff you got, well, the Suji armor, I mean. There's a laundry mat next to the bathhouse. If we got a spare time, we could wash them. I kind of want to, I kind of want to improve hey. stuff with him. Huh. Help him out. So you do get it. Alright, put your stuff down and come back here. It's about time when the Reverend realized he's talking of one. Well. Now then, since you're going to be working in my store, I'll need to hammer some homes some basics. You know what I'm talking about, right? Making coffee. Making coffee. Yep, glad to see you un at least understand that much. The store is not the busiest around in Bound, but in particular how we do things here. I'll kick you out, uh, no questions asked if you serve a bad cup. You got that? Oh, why was it one, why was it one, one music note? That, that was, I thought that was perfect. But I guess, um, that wasn't it. Let me tell you, so Chan definitely does things right with his coffee. It goes well with his special curry. Can't help but order the rest of the set meal every time. What can I say? Each of my regulars get the experience personally tailored to them. Can you tell me the key to that wonderful flavor, so Chan? I love to make it at home sometimes. Sorry, that's a trade secret. You're free to try and guess based on the taste, though. Keep skate keeping secrets from me even though you know your food's already stolen my heart. <laughs> How about a nice dessert then? It's only 300 yen. When you run, uh, rest, uh, when you run a shop, you get all sorts of consequences knowing their personality is like, absolutely vital. That's what being in the food service is all about. Well, Whoa. you. Hello there. It's been quite a while, Sakura-san. I heard you open the shop, so here I am. I wouldn't have hurt to, it wouldn't have hurt to mention to me though. Ha, huh, you got a pretty nice location. Right by the station and everything. Your order. No small talk, that's cold. Oh, but the smell. Sure brings back memories. You're still making that curry, huh? I guess you haven't gotten over it yet. Your order, sir? Ah, so pussy. I just stopped by to say hi today. But I'll be back again soon. Bye. Jeez. Uh, I don't know where he caught wind of this place. That guy seems suspicious. Uh, I guess you have an eye for some things after all. Anyways, if you have time for questions, you have time to be learning about bean types. You're not going to be able to be used to me if you can't pick up on the ABCs anytime soon. 
uh, 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 besides ladies love a guy who knows coffee, this isn't such a bad deal for you. I want the ladies to love me. <laughs> only if you were, if only you were this obedient all the time. Either way, I'm gonna teach you right. That way, I'll be able to sit back and relax while you work. Allow you to brew coffee that's slightly restored. One All right. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, it's the time already. Oh. Let's start closing up and no slacking off. You got it. After learning, I feel like my kind is Yes. Hey, it's me. Guess this number works. I forgot to ask for your cell phone number, so I had to dig it out of your papers. A real hassle, let me tell you. Anyways, are you done closing up yet? I'm gonna have you handle that from now on, so you better learn how. Uh, seems like you're a quick study, so I hope you've got the hang of it. Got it. Don't forget it. Once you're a little more settled in, I'm gonna have you do more chores. But man, not sure how I feel about calling up a guy's phone. Anyhow, we'll get the routine ground into you. That way, I might be able to take it easy. Alright, don't stay up too late. Well then. I hear good things about that Sunday's TV shopping, so want to check it out sometime? Yeah, let's do it. Hey everyone, it's time to do some shopping. Oh. Here's what I got for you today. This is the shopping that everyone, the shopping channel that everyone's been talking about. Spring awake set. You'll never fear to fall asleep again. Uh, why I? That's all we got. We gotta share a spring set. Uh, it's great for those who are concerned about their health and stamina. Oh, never got these. Hey, hey. I'm interested in the share. Oh, another buyer just called in. Thank you very much. Oh, they both sold out. That customer was extremely lucky. We'll try to get your order to you as quickly as possible. Goodbye for now. We'll see you again next time with another fabulous product. Goodbye for now. Now all we have to do is wait for it to arrive. Alright. Uh... Hey. You live in an honest life? If you can't over a new leaf, life won't be easy, you know. Yeah, this is 
Waiting. Our master awaits. Come this way. <laughs> so you've come. How does it feel slipping into the unusual from your usual life? Our master has arranged an access point to assist you in coming here directly from the real world. <laughs> that door you just went through, be thankful, inmate. This too shall aid in your rehabilitation. Make good use of it. How Time for some rip finished for now. Justine, you handle this. Registration? Already registered, okay. For some uh, how about making some? Now choose. How about make some? Keep it some this. Uh, I got it. Uh. No, don't, don't, don't get rid of that yet. Um. Pretty tough. Looks pretty tough. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. All right. Uh. Door. And. Its power that. will be nothing unusual. <laughs> I see. Finished for now. Justine, so you got handle this. A trophy. Registration. These are the paths you have walked. So it's nothing special. I got five percent. Back. Uh, Oh. Uh -huh. 
Why not? So do your best and don't get too worked up. Okay. Oh no. Come on. There we go. Oh. Slugger Pies. Oh. Better luck next time. Still got time left. You wanna keep playing? I'll keep playing. Good luck. Good luck. I will get this. Okay. Oh! oh. Okay. Here you go. You didn't miss seems like well done, I'll give you the slugger prize. Hey, hey! If I have time for one more round, I'll keep playing. Good luck! Oh! Mm -hmm. Nice hit. Okay. Offering one curse at the moment, but there will be more available once we finish the fine tuning. One head back. Let's hold back. Let me. Glad the subway was prepared so quickly. This has been one bizarre incident after another this year. Our country is going to hell. Aren't there any honest politicians out there? How can I hope to live in a country like this? Ah, you're back. I don't mind if you use the coffee maker, just clean up when you're done. Hey. Uh, you know what? came out fresh. Oh, looking, you came out there looking refreshed. Um, these medicinal baths must have been quite effective. Oh, okay, I like that. That's a, that's a lot of charm. Wanna head back? Come on, we should get you 
I'll get you home before you get cold. Hey, you were able to grab sleep. Why don't you read something until we get there? Mm -hmm. It might as well be the to learn before we cross the literature. Oh man. Did that you sucks. change your mind? Huh, you were able to grab a seat, but you're not reading? I don't feel like reading. I see, well we'll just sit back and relax until we get there, then. Hey, guess what? I'm thinking of going for a career on quiz shows. They were showing this movie called Tank Top Millionaire at the theater on Central Street. You mean the one where the boy rises, rises from a rag to riches by showing, by winning on a quiz show? Jeez, you get way too into those stories. How about staying, for example, before you think about quiz shows? Oof, you got me there. Oh. Sounds like that movie can change your worldview. Watching movies in a theater sounds like a special experience. What kind of movies do you like? Uh, comedy. comedy. Mm. Seriously? Well, that might actually suit you surprisingly enough. When I turn back into a human, how about you make you and I make our comedy duo uh, debut on the silver screen? Either way, we should check out the theaters every now and then since they're always showing you films. Jeez. I was reading the uh, essays you turned the other day and everyone's writing is so sloppy. I could care less in the case that you could still could you still have some care to live. It's I couldn't care less. I've been seen I've seen this a lot these days where people are using this phrase differently than it's real me. It reminds me of something I've been hearing saying my country right or wrong. They would have been saying it stubbornly and they knew how it was Alright, it's a comic you son. Can you tell me how the meaning of this changed? Oh yeah, hey, I, I mean Hey Lion is obviously fan can be a good guy and help her out. Huh? Um, what is he even talking about? I don't know politics. Crap, can you give me a hint here? What's that phrase originally meant to convey my country right or wrong? This is it. Exactly! The phrase was really meant to inspire you to make responsibility for keeping your country on the right path. The full quote is my country right or wrong, if right to be kept right, and if wrong needs to be set right. So you can see the original is more about taking personal responsibility for your country's future. Unfortunately these days it's more used to Justify buying support instead of actually fixing, fixing social issues. Wow, I was so not ready for that. You saved me. Nice so much. going. Nice. He seems really relieved. Hey, okay. Finally, I maxed out something. No, well, not max, but improved on something. All right. Charm has increased from existing to head turning. You're pretty good at studying, I'm impressed. Really? Alright. Uh I know this Ryuji's not texting. I should write something. I know you're not the best in school, but you can, you can be here. 
favorite. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna study some more and get some guts. Wait a minute. Let me try something real quick. Will guts be more improved if, uh, if I get the burger? Or if it's just one. If it's one, then I guess it doesn't matter. <laughs> no, it'd be better if we get uh, knowledge and that at the same time. Wonder if it's either two or three. Oh, you know, well, I can look it up, but I'd rather try. Like I said, like, I'd rather screw up my screw up on my own work. Not that this would be a screw up, but you know. Oh, I can't do it. I can't do it anyway. Uh, all right. Whatever. Well, at least I can get some books. Get some books. Please, take your time. And get some movies. Yep. Perfect. Two things that increase kindness. Now I gotta remember how to get home. It's always a pain. Oh, wait. There we go. Okay. That's that's what I want. Hmm. 
What do you want to do? Nice to meet you. We boosted at night, 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 no time. Nice to meet you. I'm Megumi Hanasaki, the owner of this shop. I'll do everything in my power, uh, do everything myself. <laughs> So you can just observe me Good and luck. try to learn the ropes. Hey! That apron suits you. Here. Well, here's your pay for today. You did great. Good work, Ren. You can come back again when you have the time. How are you feeling? Nice job. Nice job. You worked pretty hard today. I bet this job is. I bet this job making gifts has boosted your kindness. Wanna head back? Alright, we should head home soon. Ah, you're back. Hey. A package came in for you today. Can't imagine what you bought. See what hey. you Oh. Let's see what's the order from the TV. <laughs> Next time then. Hey. Yeah. Make sure you close up. So, Buchiko kept waiting. Mm. Buchiko, the story about this dog makes me cry every time. Hey, hey! Oh, I didn't realize how long you've been reading, so how far did you get? It seems like you still have some pages left. You should continue some other time. Today, huh? How do you like being packed in like sardines, city style? <laughs> I bet you've had enough. I don't mean to joke around. I just don't know what to do. I get anxious unless I'm doing something, yet here I am suddenly with nothing to do. It's so awful just waiting for the results, isn't it? It's so worrying. I'm sure things are okay. You're right. All we can do is believe and wait. <laughs> Thanks. I feel better after talking. It's not good to be a downer in the morning. Well, let's have a great day today! <sighs> I could use some fresh air. Take me somewhere outside. Really? Uh... You know what? I'm gonna go to work again. Uh, no, I'm gonna go to work again. Oh, hey. Unless... Oh, I can't hang out with him today. Ah, screw it. It's plenty of time. Hmm. Hmm. 
I apologize if I overstay my welcome. I finished the critique for my work, so I am partaking in the moment's rest. The ambience of my favorite cafe at closing time, this perfect silence soothes my very soul. TV's on though. Well, I'll be going home then. Hey! Make sure you close up. After his death, the statue of Buchi became a symbol of Shibuya. Mm. Buchi Kill, the story. Oh, I already read that. What are your thoughts? So you finished reading Buchi Kill's story. A dog who kept waiting for his master in Shibuya, huh? A noble and loyal friend to the end. I have to admit, this story moved me. Can't you feel it in your. Can you feel it uh, warm your heart too? Come on. No, come on. <laughs> you should have gave me an upgrade. <sighs> well, I guess we should go to sleep. Staying up isn't too late isn't healthy, you know. I got a chance to talk to this girl the other day. We had an amazing conversation after I brought up some of the stuff I read about. We're gonna go out somewhere together soon. Well, don't get ahead of yourself because it happened to go well. Look, knowledge isn't enough. You need proficiency to adapt on the fly. You also need kindness to be accepted, and guts to be honest and direct. Plus charm to draw people to you. The quality of your character says a lot about you, so it's important to better yourself every day. Really? But it takes so much work. But I'll do it if it means I'll get a girlfriend. I guess I'll start by showering every day. I hear girls prefer a dude who's hygienic. This applies to you, too. Of course. You get it. That's a good attitude to have. Morning! I just remembered. There have been a lot of dire news lately with the train accident and the volleyball team incident. People are theorizing that sudden, these sudden uh, psychotic breaks, but the cause is still unknown. While the unexplained occurrences like these are commonplace in the ma you. world of math, for instance, look at this. It said you only need a few colors in order to paint, so that adjacent colors are completely separated. Do you know the name of the theorem named after this number? Alright. This is it. Correct! I suppose the four color theorem is common sense. As you can see, any flat image of a map of the world or anything could be painted only using four colors. Only people have realized this principle based on experience since ancient times. However, it's difficult to prove and was an odd solved problem for a long time. Nice going. I hope the psychotic breaks don't just end up as an unsolved mystery. My heart hurts just thinking about the economic losses the string of incidents have caused. Mm. The world's full of dangers, huh? I guess even the world outside school is no good either. Really? Finally, I get to hang with Ah, uh, damn it! I just want to move better, but I can't. I was just training. I was training for the nationals back in the day, but now I totally suck balls. What the hell do you think you're doing? Whoa! Nakaoka, Takesi, Takesi. I'm so sorry for butchering the names. Running, huh? I saw you from the window. What, are you gonna try to call Qualen back to the track team? 
Uh, hell no. Hmm. Speaking of which, well, this was your secret training spot, wasn't it? Well, it's our spot now. You know us, the former track team. We don't even have a locker room anymore, thanks to someone I know. Want to train with us? What the heck is up with this guy? Hold on, aren't you the transfer student? You're really gonna hang out with this loser? Better watch out, he'll hit you the second he gets pissed off. I heard his dad was the same way, like father, like son. Now that's some scary shit. <laughs> that don't got anything to do with this. Calm down, Ryuji. <sighs> Look, back then I... I don't need to hear your excuses. Everyone was going through the same shit with Kamasita. The beatings, the impossible exercises, but we put up with all of it for the track team. But no, you had to go and fuck it all up. Man, I was stupid for you ever thinking you were my teammate. That's all I have to say to you. I'm out of here. <sighs> I nearly smacked him when he was talking about my dad. I haven't changed at all. But you know, you actually helped me calm down a bit. I'm glad you were here with me. Thanks, man. I feel like my bond with Ryuji is growing deeper. All right. Let's call it a day. Hey, Naka Koka. Why don't you kick his ass? What? The hell is your problem? Hmm? Now they're just arguing with each other. I should stay out of it. See ya. Anyways, nice train with you. Yo, it's me. You get to talk? I wanted to thank you again for today. I really owe you, man. I get pissed off so damn easily. I gotta work on that. I can't exactly blame you. Nah, this one's definitely my bad. I can't cause a scene. Don't want to get you pulled into even more bad shit. Huh, I gotta wonder what they were arguing about. But hey, I'm an outsider. Nothing to do with me. Thanks again for today. Don't forget to massage your legs before you sleep, okay? Uh, see you later. Ah, you're back. Mm. This room looks so desolate since there's nothing in here. I've got a good idea. I, I have a good idea. Bring me that chair, the one in the corner. You can reach that beam in the ceiling if you stand on this chair, right? Let's train your body during using that ceiling beam. You're not doing anything right now, there's no harm in training. I'm gonna whip you into shape so you better be prepared. Oh, you wanna do it? Okay. I wanna watch a movie. Hey! Not depending on the movie. Oh! Ah oh, man. You know what? I'll try. Oh, this. you wanna do it? Yes! Without further ado, let's begin your training. Nice going! Oh yeah, didn't you buy some protein shakes? You're quite prepared. Take protein. You have nine notes for take it. Now, let's carry out our plan. Well, we let's begin your work. Okay. Alright, you can do this. Clear your mind and focus on your center. Don't give up. Push past your limits. Hey! Hey, are you alright? You haven't built up much muscle yet, so you don't push yourself nice too hard. Going. It seems you gained some strength. Alright. Oh, it looks like you're getting results from the protein. Alright. Well then. Oh, well, it's getting late. Why don't you get some sleep? <sighs> well, 
What up? He had a change of heart for real, didn't he? It's kind of hard to believe right now. I'm gonna cry if we still get expelled after all this. Let's believe and wait. Whoa! You're so calm, man. Aren't you worried at all? Oh yeah, you free today? If you got nothing to do, come see me at the school. It's not like I got enough. I got something to say. Uh, but I find talking helps calm the nerves. close to her even now this can't be she's what are you saying it's a strange story about a woman who can speak with this the spirit hey, of the deceased hey. hmm. was a woman devoted to the spirits of the dead like that maybe you learn a thing or two about kindness from watching the drama yes Yes! All right. Well then. Well, it's starting to get late. Let's head to bed soon, okay? <sighs> All right. Uh, what are you up to? What are you doing right now? Just having this having to wait doesn't jive with me. I'm at the arcade, let me know if something comes up. Oh, hey. I guess we just have to wait, see, wait hey. and see what happens. Yo, what do you think about training for a bit? We're getting rusty. Wanna get going? Alright. We could now we just gotta wait and see. Oh. Like, yeah, I gotta return it after this, so you I gotta at least me? watch it. Please tell him the truth. Don't worry. You're safe. Can you tell me what happened? It's a strange story about a woman who can speak this you mm. already said that. But the at goes telling the truth, I'm on the edge of my seat here. Oh! 
So we finished watching Rafe, huh? Maybe you learned a thing or two about kindness from watching this <laughs> drama. Okay. Well then. Ah, uh, we were able to grab a seat. Why don't you read something until we get there? Uh... Did you change uh, your mind? I don't feel like reading. Morning! Ugh, the board meeting is the day after tomorrow. I wonder if Kamoshida really had a change of heart. What if we failed? Uh, that's all I've been able to think about! We have to believe. We did do what we could. I guess all I can do now is believe. We'll be able to avenge Shiho, and you won't get expelled. After break, we'll all be able to laugh together. That's what I'll believe. Hi, everyone. Hi, everyone. How are you all doing today? These days, you're expected to know Kolok. Ah. Kolok real anguish, I think that's how you say it. Even it's Indians that come from other languages. I want you to forget that you're Japanese during this class and make yourself believe you're a foreigner. What's important is becoming someone else. In this day age, being able to swap your mask depending on the situation is a critical talent. How will you fare? Let's hear it. Here's a question. Are you a one three kind? Let's see if you can work out the answer based on um. no. Are you a wonder kind? What well, seems to be like the, uh, like we need to work out what it, that is so we can answer properly. My German is kind of rusty, but I'll give you a hand if you can. First off, the wonder part means wonder. If so, that's something wondrous, I guess, or impressive. Next part is kind. That's probably. Wonder. Uh, okay. This is it. That's correct. Skilled of a servant was the more coins they would receive from God, their talent led to the most. Nice going! The English word talent didn't originally have anything to do with our modern concept of celebrity. But the ability to change one's mask depending on the situation is certainly a, a talent given to, to one by God. It's not too far off calling people who can react to things on the spot to be talent. <laughs> the talent of changing masks, does that make us all wonder thieves? <laughs> this waiting seems kind of boring. There's a movie theater in Shibuya, right? You wanna go there and see something? Nah, let's study. Oh, actually, hold on. Before we study, let's turn the movie. Turn the movie. Platform number 
scheduled to give a speech here tonight. If you're interested, I'd love for you to come. I want people to hear it. Let's just take on the class and experience the damn thing. I'm told you might be good at it if I forget to go. But it's at night, so we won't be able to attend without the team support rule. Okay. the movie. Take a look around. Right. doing a much better job with social stats uh, than last time because I was only able to get proficiency and I think kindness now is it and this was like in between the second palace I did that but I maxed out three things want to head back back. Poor Skullzy. But just look at these bodies. They can't be from Earth. It's a story about an investigator who searches for the truth behind eerie supernatural and Hey hey! The atmosphere of this show is so ominous, I'm getting creeped out. <sighs> that was intense. I can barely breathe through all that. I bet you're summoning a little more guts by watching this drama. It's starting to get late, let's get to bed soon, okay? Hmm. No, no surprise, waiting to be bored, I wonder what booty in the restaurant too. Well, that reminds me of this, oh! Well, oh, say, say less!
All right. <laughs> I love the feeling of noodles sliding down my throat. That's sus, friend. That's sus. That sits the best, man. Ramen is life. Light soup like this really gets your body going after a good run. We used to come all the way down here after practice, and I guess that's on the past. <sighs> By the way, I've seen Nakagoka around here a few times. For some reason, it don't look like he's getting along with the others. Are you worried about him? <sighs> I've been thinking about what you said, how the whole track team was putting up with Kamashito shit. And how I effed it all up for them. I think he was right. They don't even got a club from anymore, so they've been storing all their stuff behind the gym. They can't use their school gear either, so they just run laps around the block for practice. There ain't really a place for outcasts like that. I should know that better than anyone. It's good they're keeping their heads low for now. I don't want to man up like me. I know how you feel. Oh yeah, we're both Valcast here, huh? It's probably tough just walking around school for you with all them rumors and shit. Hey, we don't really belong anywhere, but you know, maybe they ain't so bad after all. I guess now that I'm thinking about it, trying to fit in is a real pain in the ass. I mean, I never met you guys if I wasn't an outcast, right? So it's all good. <laughs> for real, though. It's been a shit ton of fun. Hanging out with you guys is so freaking cool. I feel like my bond with Ryuji is growing deeper. Alright. Hmm. I just hope there's something I can do to help those track guys. Though I'd probably mess it up for them if I tried to put in. Oh yeah, we still gotta find a spot for our training. I'll think about it. No slacking off till then, okay? See ya! Hey! Tomorrow's the board meeting. Don't worry, I'm sure the heart of ch the change of heart will work. Tomorrow's the board meeting, right? If we're gonna get expelled, if Kondrasita doesn't have a change of heart by then. I'm sure he will. He'll definitely change. It won't be a real problem for us. It would be a real problem if he didn't. You're right. It would be... It's a little too early to be given up now. Guess we're gonna find out one way or the other tomorrow. Guess we gotta brace ourselves for the possibility. I'm sorry I can't offer more reassurance, but he should have the change of heart. Let's just believe in that while we wait for tomorrow. Hey! Shaking of the washing machine makes it feel pretty comfortable when you sit on top. Oh! Oh, it looks like it's done. And oh, finished. this is much cleaner than I expected. Let's head back. <sighs> this is no good. Mondays are such a drag. Why couldn't they give us the day off to the, to the day off too? We have the rest of the week starting off tomorrow. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Speaking of, what's with the calling card? The one sent to Kamasita? Didn't it say something about stealing his disordered desires? Or something weird like that? 
something like that. I'm sure it's just a prank. No one's taking it seriously. What's with the sudden morning assembly? I bet it's about that girl that jumped the other day. They don't have to tell us not to commit suicide. There was that weird calling card too, so I guess the teachers are freaking out. We're lucky that morning practice got canceled though. I feel like I'm gonna faint if this takes forever. <sighs> Let's begin this school-wide morning assembly. As you all know, a tragic event took place the other day. Thankfully, we have been informed that she has pulled through. But it will take time until she recovers. Everyone here has a bright future ahead. I implore that you rethink the importance of life and... <laughs> Mr. Kamashita, what's the... I... have been reborn. That is why I will confess everything to you all. What's wrong with Mr. Kamoshida? What's this about? Confess? Did the volleyball team do something? I have repeatedly done things that were unbecoming of a teacher. Verbally abusing students, physically abusing my team, and sexually harassing female students. I am the reason why Shiho Suzui tried to kill herself. Sexual harassment? What? Why would he oh, say that uh, himself? He is the team? worst. Really? Physical abuse? I thought of the school as my own castle. There were even students that I sentenced to expulsion simply because I didn't like them. I will, of course, rescind those. I am truly sorry for putting innocent youths through such horrible acts. I am an arrogant, shallow and shameful person no i'm worse than that i will take responsibility i kill myself for it what did he just say that we kill himself mr mm. kamoshida is uh, not well mr kamoshida please died. get off the stage for now everyone return to your classes i don't run, you bastard! Shiho's still alive, even after all the things that made her want to die! You have no right to run from this! You're right. You're absolutely right. I should be punished under the law and atone for my crimes. I did horrible things to Takamaki-san as well. In return for giving Suzui-san a position on the team, I... I tried to force her into having relations. Disgusting. Uh, for a position on the team? I feel so That's bad horrible. for Takamaki-san. So the rumors son. weren't true. As of today, I will resign from my position as an instructor and turn myself in. <laughs> Someone please call the police! The police? Is he for real? He's gonna wow. get arrested? Oh my god. This morning's assembly is over. Return to your classes immediately. Isn't this just like what that calling card said? I forgot said? how intense these uh chains of hearts really do be like in the, in these games. Does this mean the Phantom Thieves thing was for real? Was something done to Kamashita? Come on, there's no way you could steal someone's heart. But why else would he start saying things like he'll kill himself or turn himself in? Maybe because it almost got leaked. Don't they go easier on you if you turn yourself in? I wonder what happened. Who knows? But man, Kamashita turned out to be one sick bastard. Hey, is this for real? He's turning himself in just like that? What's going to happen to the volleyball team? Marasi will show us. This is gonna be a Return to your classrooms at once! His heart really did change. Seems like it. But... Was this really for the best? I think so. Yeah, it's gotta be. But things are happening way too fast. Huh? What the... Takamaki-san, I'm sorry. Huh? We all knew, but we pretended we didn't. Takamaki-san, I had you all wrong. I'm sorry that I spread rumors about you. 
I didn't know at all. But Kamashita was forcefully pushing himself on you. It must have been so hard for you. I'm sure there's a ton of people who want to apologize to you. We're so sorry. No, it's okay. The same goes for me, too. Besides, that's all in the past now. Hey, you there! Return to class at once! Well, see you later then. I can't apologize enough for what I did to you. I swear I'll make it up to you someday. Looks like Kamoshida ain't the only one that had a change of heart. Man, I'm glad for you. Looks like those weird rumors are gonna go away. My thing doesn't really matter. We made Kamoshida apologize about Shiho. That's more than enough for me. You should hurry and tell her about it then. Yeah. I totally freaked out. He really did have a change of heart. And we were lucky his mind didn't get messed up either. <laughs> this was an A-plus job. Does this mean that they won't have a mental shutdown even if their palace disappears? I see. So we need to persuade the shadow without killing it, and then send it back to its real self. Our targets won't undergo a cognitive collapse if we do that. So we can get him to confess with no bad stuff? Hey, that works for me. Do you have to be so loud? Eh, don't worry about it. So, how'd it go? With Shiho, I mean. She's regained consciousness. For real? It was only for a little bit, but I got to talk to her. I was able to tell her that Kamoshida admitted to what he did. Shiho, she... She told me she was sorry. Looks like she found out that I was flirting with Kamoshida for her sake. And here I was, wanting to apologize to her. Kamoshida's at fault for all this. I know. Shiho's mom is thinking of transferring her to another school after she recovers. The whole sexual harassment and attempted suicide... People will label her after that. Sounded like Shiho had the same idea, too. Ah, it's gonna get lonely. But I think it's for the best. I'm sure it'll be hard if she stays here. She's alive. You can see her anytime. I need to change, too. That aside, I was surprised you could hold yourself back against Kamoshida's shadow. It wasn't like that. I just wanted Kamoshida to apologize himself. You're so kind, Lady On. No matter how much of a shitbag he was, finishing him off would have left a bad aftertaste, huh? Huh? That's not it. I think revenge is better served if I make him repent. Realizing what he's done, he'll grovel for forgiveness the rest of his life. You know? I just believe there are fates worse than death. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, anyways, that's all settled. But, you know, there was one more thing I was wondering about that castle. Why was Kamoshida the only one who had that metaverse thing? It isn't necessarily limited to him. It's something anyone could have, if their heart became warped from their desires. Anyone? Wanna check it out? Not right now. We better lay low for a while. People are still gonna be talking about Kamoshida. Then again, it's totally impossible for someone to find out what we did at his palace. Yeah, about that? Weird rumors about you guys are already going around. Stuff like you got together and threatened Kamoshida with something close to physical violence. The hell? People aren't going to easily believe that phantom thieves really exist. Calling cards being treated like it was a prank by someone who knew what Kamoshida was doing. Hmm. Makes sense. We're the ones who did it, and I still don't completely believe it myself. <laughs> Let's wait for things to settle down for the time being. Anyways, let's check how much this metal can be sold for. It'd be better if we pawned it off ASAP. Ooh, got a hit! Wait, 30,000 yen? That's all a gold medal's worth? Remember that time in middle school? I lent you some money. There's no way I borrowed 30,000 yen from you. Wouldn't it be around that much with compounded interest? 
interest my ass. I'm not saying that I'm taking all of it. I mean, it's your fault for not paying me back all these years. It's just common sense. Ah, damn it. <laughs> I agree on laying low and keeping an eye on the situation. However, you dragged me into this. It would be nonsense not to celebrate a successful mission. I guess we could blow this dirty money on something fun. Discussions among phantom thieves are to take place over luxurious food. Hey, wait! Ah, uh, I guess it's fine. There's somewhere I want to go then. Where's that? It's a place Shiho and I have been wanting to go for a while. I owe money, so I can't complain. You good with that? Fine by me. I'll leave it to your discretion as well, Lady On. I'll call and check the prices later then. When should we go? Want to do it soon, like tomorrow? Why don't we go on the last day of the holidays? It'll help energize us when school life starts up again the day after. Then, uh, the fifth, on Children's Day. So, who's going to sell this? Leave that to us. We know a store that'll buy anything, don't we? Okay, I'll leave that to you guys. Ah, you're back. No, that one is a fake. It's just a byproduct of his cognition. The real metal should still be in his possession. proud of that once-in-a-lifetime gold medal ever again. Depending on how you look at it, that punishment might be even worse than death for him. <sighs> Yo. Hey! Oh! Can I help you? To their brains. We need to find those samples, Skelzy. Fast! <sighs> whoa, whoa, why would you preserve an alien larvae? Fiasi killed the cat, you know. Oh! Me out instead of sleeping your life away. You do owe it to him. We'll just have to wait, hurry down, and help him. <laughs> Sorry, I kind of pressured you into doing this. And now to our next topic 
Fall from Grace, the story of a dishonored Olympic medalist. Just recently, a high school coach confessed at an assembly that he had been repeatedly abusing students. Given his prior Olympic achievements, this has caused quite a stir. What caused this habitual offender to suddenly confess these heinous crimes to his entire school? The police are hoping that the upcoming interrogations will bring light to this question. Isn't this... My friends would come back from practice with bruises all the time. It was scary, but I'm relieved that the abuse is finally going to end now. He would touch me and stuff all the time. I'm glad I don't have to deal with that sexual harassment anymore. There were always rumors, sure. Not many people believed them, though. Like, I'm totally shocked they were actually true. At least now I can go to school without worrying. I knew it. This is your school, isn't it? Seems like it. Uh, things might be getting turbulent at school, but you need to just keep your head down, all right? More importantly, keep those hands moving. I've got some more stuff I need you to do. Man! The chief really worked this hard. Did you see it? It was on the news. No way the school's gonna be able to play dumb after that. I saw it too. Seal's name didn't come up though, right? Not that I saw, but I bet they wanted to keep that part quiet. I'm so glad. It's finally over then. All we gotta do is stuff our faces and put this Kamashido crap behind us. I'm totally looking forward to this celebration party. I'll try not to let you guys down. Okay. All right, let's do this. Let's, let me see your fighting spirit. Now, let's carry out our plan. Well, let's begin your training. Okay. All right, you can do this. Clear your mind and focus on your center. Don't give up. Put past your limits. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Good job, let's keep up nice the hard work. Going. It seems you've gained some strength. Alright. Alright. Well then. Make sure to do the dishes. Make sure to do the dishes. Oh, uh, oh you already said it, never mind. <laughs> When I get back, just do it. Don't get cocky with me. Welcome. Am I interrupting something? Not at all. The cause of the runaway train incident in the subway the other day still has not been found. Police are hurrying to solve the matter as it may relate to the rise in psychotic breakdown incidents. Oh, is that the thing everyone's been talking about? Doesn't it make you curious? People who were living normal lives suddenly went mad or deranged out of the blue. Not to mention that it's happening one after another. Could they really be coincidental? Hmm. Leaving that aside, what do you have? Hmm. I'll have the house blend, please. Are you a part-timer? I'm surprised this place can afford one. Uh, what, no. <laughs> Not exactly. Are you a high school student? Where do you attend? Shujin Academy. Oh, someone I know goes there as well. I've heard that things are rough right now. A teacher named Kamoshida confessed his crimes like he was a completely different person, supposedly. And it happened all of a sudden one day. Can a person's mental state change so easily? Huh. <sighs> Is my drink ready yet? Coming right up. Alright, today's the day we turn in that metal for cash. You know some place that'll buy it off you, right?
right. I forgot that. That's what makes me oh. I have to sell things too. Hey. Works for me. Why? Yes, there are some matters we'd like to discuss with you today. Go, kids. Do you know why we're here? <laughs> I don't know. Looking for evidence? You tell me, Mr. Detective. Watch your attitude. Well, you guys gonna search me? Go on. Do you what you gotta do. What was that? An upstanding citizen is not gonna, uh, supposed to cooperate with the cops, right? Hey, you sure that lead was a legitimate? I could have sworn it was. <laughs> Can you two hurry it up? I got business to run here. You bastard. Hey, you. What's in the bag? Show me. The kid's just a regular old customer. You can check the tapes if that'll convince you. They'll show everything that's gone down here today. I don't want to be here when the detectives see the footage of me with that bill. Well, I should leave. I won't let you get away with that easily, so let's switch in the bag. It's none of your business. <laughs> I said, show it to me. Hey, you're talking to a kid, remember? Besides, he's not the one we're here to see. Uh, that's right, Mr. Detective. Maybe next time, try not to harass my customers. See, see how that goes. See ya. Safe trip home, kid. What were those detectives doing there? More importantly, aren't you curious about what's in the bag? Maybe a little. Well, come on, let's open it up. A real gun? Wait, I think it's just a model. It's incredible, though. Miles ahead of the one Ryuji had. There's something weird about that place. Hey, I just had a great idea. We should totally buy this gun from him later. I mean, it's perfect. Something this real looking would work wonders in the metaverse. Anyway, he told you to bring it back the next time you came, right? You should try striking a deal with him when we go to return it. It's getting a lot of coverage. I'm still not sure about that. The reaction's been bigger than what I was expecting. I guess I'm just... surprised. I don't think we did anything wrong, though. I wonder if we helped those people speak up about it. I'm sure we did. That's pretty amazing, huh? I didn't think we'd actually be able to do it. And yet, look at us now! This calls for a celebration. Let's meet in front of Shibuya Station at noon tomorrow. Don't be late! Oh, and did you pawn off that medal? You didn't forget, right? I remembered. Good to hear! I already made reservations. You should be really excited about the place I chose, by the way. I'm sure everyone's gonna love it. Well, see you guys tomorrow! Ah, a restaurant of Lady Anne's choosing. Finally, a decent meal. Hey, what do you think we're gonna be eating? Ooh, tuna, sea urchin, and maybe even salmon roe. In any case, I'm surely looking forward to it.
For real? Okay. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So that's four skills I gotten ever since. This is going really well. All right. Well then. I just need to up my knowledge. Mmm. <laughs> so good. No wonder Lady Han chose this place. Of course it's good. This is a famous hotel after all. Oh yeah. I heard that the police are coming to interview some people at school. That's troublesome. Our names are gonna come up for sure. People are spreading all sorts of rumors about us and Kamoshida. But we got him pumped up. I keep hearing stuff like the Phantom Thieves really stole his heart. I think most people don't believe it, but some of them actually seem grateful. You know what? I noticed something interesting. I already know that On is like a has that affinity for sweets. So it's funny. So it seems An has a bunch of cakes and pies and all that good stuff. Let's go with tea. Let's see over there. Wow, Yuji has a bunch of meat. Like a meat lover. And I'm here with this fruit. <laughs> and I guess pancakes. Too. Look at this. The Phantom Aficionado website? Well done, Phantom Thief. Now I can keep going too. Thank you for giving us hope. Pretty cool, huh? I was just desperate to deal with my own problems, but seeing people saying all this feels strange. Yeah. Hey, what do we do now? We good on time. Huh? Oh crap, you're totally right! We only got an hour to eat! Just 50 God, I'm not gonna finish all the beef dishes at this pace. I need to eat my way through the entire dessert menu. Look after our stuff. We'll snag something for you guys too. Don't worry. Oh man, God melts in my mouth. Seriously, only meat? Now where should I start? And she's all about the cake. So happy. Hey, calories. Shut up! How much do you think one of these costs? I'll never get the chance to do this again! Mmm, the Wilton Hotel Cake Buffet! I'd heard rumors, but I never thought it'd be so amazing! And where's our share? I didn't really know what you'd want. So I just grabbed you some beans. B beans? There were some pretty bizarre things there, too, so we got you a variety of those. Fried bananas, preserved eggs, and some kind of beans. M more beans? We put so much on the plate that it got all mixed up, but it should probably still taste good. This is just plain grotesque. Let's go. These two just don't know what fine dining means. We'll show them. Leave it to me. That's reassuring. You guys watch our things while we're gone. Wait patiently for our return. Mm. Oh, it's like a meaty explosion in my mouth. Oh, this part's cream cheese! They're not even listening. As I'd expect from the buffet at a top-class hotel. The ingredients and variety of dishes are crazy good. There's a reason it costs 8,000 yen. They have a lot here. But fish should come first. Let's fill our plate with all sorts of fish. Which table do you think they're at? Ooh, look! There's the fish! I'd prefer it raw, but grilled is great too. 
Have you heard, my dear? The news about that Kamoshida fellow was absolutely dreadful. Oh, right. That teacher at Shujin Academy? Caught doing such indecent acts. Shameful, really. Hold on a sec. And they still haven't managed to solve those horrible psychotic breakdown episodes, have they? Oh, I wish they wouldn't let themselves be distracted by such a tawdry scandal. Perhaps it's a sign of how peaceful this country is. I honestly pity those poor Shujin students, though. Hmm. Hmm. Shoot! They noticed you! Just grab some food and act natural. On the plus side, we'll get to eat the food later. Oh, how did a child like this end up in here? I certainly hope you didn't bring friends. I prefer my meals to remain hooligan-free. Thank you very much. Come, let us go. What's so bad about kids coming to enjoy a buffet? Hmm. I wonder how the other people here are reacting to the news. Let's get some more food and listen in. Maybe there are more people we can eavesdrop on at other tables. Rice is incredible! It's the cornerstone of every great meal! Sorry, I got a bit carried away there. So, the ratings for the news were really that good? It was because it was about that teacher who sexually harassed his student, huh? Was it Kamoshida? It's all about how you frame it. You've got to cater to the idiotic public. Ratings go up when you show them crude, sensational news and make it easy for them to understand. How can he be so insensitive? A student almost killed herself because of that Kamoshida. By the way, do you think these sudden changes of heart might be real? Well, that's... Hmm? Quick, grab some food! Oh, and don't forget the crispy bits. So, because he had a sudden change of heart, he just confessed to all his crimes? <laughs> Who knows? Sorry, but it's time. I have to go. I'll call you again after the meeting. A sudden change of heart, huh? I suppose I can't blame him for seeing it that way. Hmm. I wonder how the other people here are reacting to the news. Let's get some more food and listen in. Got distracted. When you really look at it, he's just an ex-athlete who overestimated himself. He should have just accepted his lot in life and quietly done his job as a teacher. It's not even an incident we can take seriously. The whole story is pretty ridiculous. We should probably look into it. But we can also just let the low-ranking scrubs handle it. Look into? I guess they're investigating Kamoshida? They don't- Hmm? Gah! Grab some food! Ah, get the part that's not too fatty. He's gonna be arriving soon. We don't want to keep him waiting, so we better get going too. What is he going to discuss with the higher ups? Well, I'm sure it's more important than lunch. They were dressed quite well, but they still looked pretty shady to me. Hmm. It looks even bigger and more delicious. This giant sweet. I got distracted. News travels quick. It's already all over the internet. You know, the story about how Kamoshida got his ass kicked by some world reforming heroes. It doesn't sound like a serious story to me. Some of the details are pretty far fetched. Don't worry about it. We just have to do what they tell us to do. It's all rumors made up by school kids anyway. If it's gripping news, who cares if it's not true? So they don't believe themselves. But they're making up stories to make the Phantom Thieves seem real. And they're doing this in front of the actual Phantom Thieves. Hmm? Well, act fast and get some food! And make sure it's got a lot of whipped cream! What's wrong? Ah, uh, nothing. I thought some weird kid was looking at us. Why don't we go? 
It's almost time for the meeting. Well, that was rude. Did you hear him? He said you were weird. I don't think there's anyone else we can listen in on, but it's shocking. So many of the adults here don't seem like nice people. Now, according to what we heard, it seems most adults aren't very interested in the news about Kamoshida. Well, now that we've got a nice variety of food on our plates, let's head back to the others. <laughs> you brought a ton back! What do you think about coming up against such ritzy food? I'm so happy. <laughs> it's cute hearing that from someone like you. It just don't get too excited, got it? You're the last person I want giving advice about that, Ryuji. Don't you think you're eating too much, Mona? Mm. There's no... Mm. Knowing when we'll get to come here again. Uh, sure, but you guys brought back loads of food. It'd be a shame to let it all go to waste. Why don't you help them out, Ryuji? Oh, we should both help. Oh, me? I'm way too stuffed. I couldn't possibly help. Yeah, stuffing your face with cake. Whatever, let's deal with this ourselves. There's still more? Don't give up. Let's keep at it. We... we did it. Oh yeah. This is a victory for all of us. Is this again to you? Not exactly. Good job, you guys. How about one last dish to cleanse your palates? I recommend the seasonal tart. The grapefruit has both alluring sweetness and a tangy sourness. Uh, stop. I don't want to hear about sour stuff. Uh, this isn't good. I gotta go to the bathroom. Well, me too. Please carry me gently. My, look at that table. Come now, pay them no attention. I'm sure they must not normally have the chance to eat such exquisite food. I can only imagine what their parents must be like. What was that? <laughs> We don't got time for that. Come on, let's go! Ugh, I'm stuffed. I totally panicked when I saw the closed for cleaning sign at the bathrooms. You were talking big about eating until you puked, but you really did puke. Are you some kind of moron? Hey, same goes for you! What floor was that restaurant on? We came up to get here, so it has to be on a lower floor, right? What the? There's still no update on the case. Not yet. Excuse me, but why are you so involved? It's not something you should be concerned with. I don't care about your opinion, you incompetent buffoon. When I say pick up the pace, you do it! Hey, you're cutting in line! What do you want? We were here first. We're in a hurry. Oh, I'm sorry. So you can butt in front of other people if you're in a hurry? It seems the customer base has changed since I was here last. Have they started a daycare? What? Sir, we don't have time for this. I know. Don't bother with them. What the hell was with that bossy guy? Shouldn't we head back down? Yeah, but... That dick really pissed me off. He wasn't even hiding the fact that he looks down on everyone. Don't lose your temper over this. I just can't forgive shitty adults like that! What's wrong? I'm okay. You not feeling good? He almost never eats well after all. Plus, I'm always stuck eating canned cat food. Yeah, that's 
sir bullshit makes me sick. Damn it! What took you so long? Why are you all pissy? Sorry. I had a run-in with some woman a second ago. She bumped into me, but then said it was all my fault when she dropped her plate. <laughs> Sounds like a real bitch. Yeah. Thanks, though. But... The restaurant workers all looked at me with this disapproving expression. I wonder if we're out of place here. It's always like this. <clears throat> hey, Morgana. What is it? Anyone could have a palace, yeah? Anyone with a strong, distorted desire. Same for them having a change of heart if their treasure gets stolen? That would be the case. Why are you bringing this up all of a sudden? We had trouble earlier, too. These selfish shitheads who just look down on everyone else. I was just wondering if we'd be able to change those kinds of people, too. You mean, you want to continue as the Phantom Thieves? I've been thinking. We put a lot of work into changing Kamoshida's heart, but nobody believes in the Phantom Thieves. Plus, those guys who had no other choice but to just deal with it are thanking us. Us, of all people! There are a lot of victims. I... I agree. If we ignore people who are in trouble, I'd go back to being the same as I was before. Well, that's true. You're under my tutelage. There's nothing we can't accomplish as phantom thieves. Shouldn't we be able to help him out? But... that means we'll have to fight shadows again. Indeed. That can't be avoided. Eh, I'm sure we'll manage. <laughs> right? I want to help people. Even if you guys are still just fledglings, this means we're an actual organization now. Fledglings? <laughs> That's actually pretty fitting for us. All right, it's settled. We're gonna catch all these shitty adults by surprise and make ourselves known to the world. Are you okay being our leader? Of course. No objections here? I can't handle all that responsibility stuff. Where's my say in this? But Lady Ahn made the recommendation, so I'll allow it. Well, should we decide on a name for our group? Yeah, I just went with Phantom Thieves of Hearts last time, but don't you think a real name would be cooler? Ooh, I've got it. I want it to be something both cute and luxurious sounding. Let me see. How about the diamonds? <laughs> I'm getting the real Little League baseball feel from it. Well then, here's my suggestion. How about Tilefish Poilé? Tile, uh, what? That's what I ate earlier. It's commemorative, no? Hell no, you idiot! Uh, you decide for us. Busters, let's go with this name. Huh, that's not bad at all. A good name. For a rookie. We going with that? If that's okay. Well, now that the name's set, who's our next target? There are tons of rotten adults and all. Why not just stick to targeting big names? along those lines. If we go after some bigwig, it's gotta get on the news, right? Don't you think more people would believe in us if we did that? That's not a bad idea. For you, Ryuji. True. If we become better known, 
we might be able to give courage to a lot more people. I don't really like the idea of just picking someone out of the blue, though. Let's narrow it down to someone we can all agree on, then. Hold on. Sorry, guys. Um, I was returning something and UPS was trying to pick it up. So... I was gonna end it anyway, eventually. So we need a so big wig, we decide on unanimous. About ten minutes. I like that unanimous decision part. It's like we're making some kind of pact. Now then, this is the official formation of the Phantom Thieves organization. Oh no! Our time for the buffet ran out. I guess we'll just have to talk more tomorrow. Another world in which people's distorted cognitions take shape? Stealing treasure to change hearts? And on top of that, a talking cat told you all this. Honestly speaking, that all sounds absurd. It's hard to believe that this is even worth listening to. Still, it can't be considered nonsense when parts of it align with Kamoshida's confession. The same goes for the testimonies of the officers who arrested you. But so be it. At any rate, you mentioned something more important. These two other accomplices, besides this talking cat thing that appeared in your story. From what you've been telling me, they're students at the same school, aren't they? Perhaps. Perhaps? Don't take me for a fool. Very well, I'll leave it at that. The questioning's not over anyway. If you are making this up, the cracks in your story will prove it. The next to receive a calling card was this individual, a master of Japanese arts, Ichiryusai Madarame. It's even more incomprehensible than Kamoshida as to why this man was targeted. Where did you come to know him? And how did you learn of his crimes when you weren't a victim of them? Start by telling me what you all schemed. Huh? I'm liking the sound of that. I hope we can really help people. I'm curious about that Phantom of Asiano website too. I wonder who made it. No clue. More importantly, you see the survey on there? I don't know how I feel about it. Yeah, there was this approval rating thing. It was like only 6%. That's better than I expected. I guess it's not so bad to put it that way. But don't you want to get it higher than that? I bet it'll go up tons if we keep like, taking down big targets. It's pretty damn exciting if you try and think of it like that. You're, you know you're right. Well then, let's keep moving, working hard from this point on. Oh yeah, let me send this. Celebrating the founding of the Phantom Thieves and celebrating a scratch in that classy buffet. You can cool it with the celebrating at any time now. Wait, you took that while I was eating? And you didn't tell me? Uh, I did, you just never stopped eating. Anyways, this is our start of the Phantom Thieves. We're gonna take the world by storm. All the city adults in the world better watch out for us. Alright, I think I'm gonna end it here. I know I can probably put another half an hour in it, but I... I that editing was insane. So I'm just gonna keep it short for now. If it's a palace or anything, no, okay. So if it's a palace or anything, I'm willing to go either three hours or over it. But if it's anything outside of that, I'll just keep it the, keep it as short as I can. I don't know if that sounds fair, but you know, I I it'd be easy, it's easier to edit when it's like uh I guess outside stuff. I can do a lot of like interesting things with that but uh with the palace it's like i gotta like 
minimize like minimize like like if I die, you know, I try to like cut it short because like you no know, some I I'm not the best persona player. Uh, I'm I'm good, but I, I don't know if I'm like as good as like you know everyone else. I'm trying to get to that level, and I'm trying to 100% this whole thing. While it's 100% more things, I don't think I'm 100% everything like the original achievements in the original game. But I want to aim at least close to it. If I get at least a quarter or a half of the original. Uh, achievements, then I will be very glad. I would be very happy to know that I put a dent into something, even if I didn't work. So, Darkware out. Thanks for watching my journey. If you want to see more, subscribe to my friend, Darkware the Awkward Guy. He is pretty awkward. Also, like the music playing. It's made just for this scene. Anyways, until next time.